Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky on Thursday expressed confidence in his country's victory over invading Russian forces with fears mounting of strikes on the war's first anniversary. The nearly year-long conflict has seen Western leaders step up their support for Kyiv, and on Thursday G7 ministers discussed new sanctions on Russia as the UN-General Assembly prepared to vote on a motion calling for lasting peace. We have not broken down, we have overcome many ordeals and we will prevail. We will hold to account all those who brought this evil, this war to our land," Zelensky said on social media. In the capital Kyiv, which saw Russian troops at its doorstep at the start of the invasion last February, and relentless attacks on energy infrastructure since, residents remain defiant. This has been the most difficult year of my life and that of all Ukrainians," said Diana Shestakova, 23, who works for a publishing house and whose boyfriend has spent the last year away in the army. I am sure that we will be victorious, but we don't know how long we will have to wait and how many victims there are still to come. In the western city of Elviv, a Swiss artist projected images in honor of Ukraine on public buildings on Wednesday night, covering them in blue and yellow peace doves and Ukrainian tridents. Ahead of the war's first anniversary on February 24, Ukraine's military intelligence intelligence chief said Russia was planning a missile attack to mark the day. February 23 minus 24, they have two dates, Kirillo Budinov said in an interview to newspaper Ukrainskaya Pravda, adding, believe me, we have survived this more than 20 times already. The year-long conflict has devastated swaths of Ukraine, turned Russia into a pariah in the West and according to Western sources, has caused 150,000 casualties on each side. In India, group of seven finance ministers met in the city of Bengaluru to discuss further sanctions and more financial help for Ukraine.